welcome to my ASMR. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Hello, welcome to my decorate with me. I almost just said get ready with me. But today I am decorating my Nintendo Switch Lite. Tomorrow, I, I won't be. What? Anyway, I'm just rubbing it down, <laughs> wiping it down with some rubbing alcohol. And I am using this skin I got from Etsy. Everything that I use to decorate my Switch is from Etsy. And everything will be in the description box, of course. So applying the skin is not that hard, but if you're a perfectionist, you'll definitely get frustrated at some parts. Cause the way I did it, it didn't fit perfectly, but it was good enough for me. So I use this random makeup brush and a blow dryer just to smooth out the skin because there will be there was some air bubbles and the blow dryer just I don't know the science but it helps stretches it out so that the air bubbles go away if I'm being honest I have no idea what I'm doing at this part I think I was trying to poke the skin into this like indent that's on the switch but uh, <laughs> There was literally no purpose. I, I don't know. I thought it was effective at the time. I don't know. But don't try to do that. Just try to stretch um, the skin over the switch as much as you can because then we have to go do the back part. So the back part was kind of easy. I struggled at some parts, but it ended up working out just with the blow dryer making sure you stretch everything out those side parts though uh, they were a little weird like I wanted to cut them out but it's fine it's fine just <laughs> do your best I forgot to mention make sure the blow dryer is on low I don't think it makes a difference but I don't know you don't want to overheat your light I guess I don't know I'm not a scientist so I finished applying the skin, was satisfied with my result, and now I'm going to add these LV stickers. And I say LV because I don't want nobody suing me, dog. So the LV stickers were kind of hard for, well not hard, it took a little while because I wanted it to be as perfect as possible, <laughs> even though it did not, it did not end up being like that. Um, I just wanted the spacing and the pattern to be good enough I guess um so yeah oh oh my gosh those dots those dot stickers were so the dot stickers one because they're hard to like stick on like my hand is cramping up it was just <laughs> a mess but it was fun at the same time so I call myself a wannabe perfectionist because I'm not a perfectionist perfectionist I guess but I like to do the most like right here I'm just cutting off the logo just so it looks like you know real like it came fresh out the Vuiz Luton <laughs> the Vuiz Luton warehouse look at it look <laughs> okay so here I am being a wannabe perfectionist again just added some stickers to that bottom part and I added just like one strip to the front because I got it <laughs> but it looks good it worked out it's pretty fresh out the Vuiz Luton warehouse so for a little razzle dazzle I'm adding some butterflies now because they're a trend because I actually love butterflies okay this right here is a monarch butterfly then blue butterflies in y'all Instagram filters morpho butterflies I've been studying butterflies since I was five okay Okay, and I'm sorry I lied in the beginning. These gems aren't from Etsy. They're like leftover from another art project. I think I got them from Walmart or Target or something. I can't remember. I'm sorry. But I'll look for them and I'll put them in the description. I, um, I lied again. These thumb grips are from Amazon. Not everything I use is from Etsy. The this clear case is from Amazon. Wow, I'm such a liar. Wow. But it'll be in the description box, okay? All right. <laughs> Okay, thank God, because I did not want to feel like a fraud. This charm is actually from Etsy. Um, the seller, she actually has a pink one, but it was sold out. But I really wanted a charm, so I got the gold one. Um, 
and it, the gold doesn't really match with the silver gems which is why i eventually ended up taking them off surprise f the gems they're ugly <laughs> probably wondering where the nails came from um you probably should mind your business yeah <laughs> but yeah this is the end result thank you for watching i hope you had fun goodbye